If you are looking to install best Android OS on your system or you can say best Android emulator for gaming purposes and maybe you are wondering to install Android 9 stable version on your system without affecting your existing system. So in this video I'm gonna show you how you can install a stable version of Android 9 and it is completely optimized for gaming purposes or you can install any Android game without affecting your existing system. So basically LD Player 9 has been launched with Android 9 stable version for best and smoother gaming. If you are a gamer and have low end system and want to install any Android game on your system, want to play any Android game on your 2GB, 4GB, 8GB, any RAM you have, you can use it without any kind of issues. So here you can see LD Player 9 and LD Player 4. So LD Player 9 comes with Android 9, LD Player 4 is for Android 7. So it is older version but 9 version is more faster and more optimized for gaming purposes. So I'm gonna show you the complete process, how you can install it and what settings you need to do so basically in this you can install any game or you can install any Android app using Play Store right so if you're looking forward to install any Android OS on your system so you can use this so just click on this LD Player 9 and if you are not able to see in your country so you can use the VPN as well but I think it is available everywhere so no issue at all before installing this it is recommended to enable the virtualization technology in your system so what you can do just right click on taskbar go to task manager and go into performance click on the CPU and here you will see virtualization it is enabled or not so in my case it is enabled but in your case maybe it is not enabled so what you can do just go into BIOS and I'm going to show you some pictures according that you need to enable that basically you need to look for Intel virtualization technology so somewhere it is written like virtualization so you need to enable that and that's it so in Asus you can see here you need to press F seven to go into advanced mode and after that you need to go into advanced section and in advanced section you will see here CPU configuration so just click on it and you will see here like Intel virtualization technology so just enable it and that's it if you have different BIOS so don't worry about that just look for the virtualization technology somewhere in advanced setting or in CPU settings right so you can find it very easily after restarting go into again task manager in task manager you will see here virtualization is enabled so minimum requirement for this LD player 9 is Intel AMD CPU processor with 32 bit and 64 bit Windows XP 7 8 8.1 10 and 11 is also supported here DirectX 11 and you can see here minimum RAM required is 2 GB RAM 36 GB free hard disk space and hardware virtualization technology should be enabled so that's why I enable this virtualization technology because it is recommended and recommended requirement you can see Intel i5 10th generation or better and 16 GB and uh, disk space 100 GB and uh, if you have any graphics card with Nvidia or AMD it will be great and after that we have downloaded loaded this LD player 9 just open it just uh, click here install so now I have restarted my system and we have installed this LD player 9 open it so now you can see we have set up this LD Player 9 successfully and whenever you click on the system apps you will see here settings, browser, file manager and play store. So just open it. Before opening you need to sign in with your any Google account which I already did and uh, you can see here games, apps and movies and books. So like you want to install Adobe or Microsoft Office, Word, Excel, whatever you want you can get here right. You can use whichever app you want like I'm going to install Free Fire. Just search for it and you can see Kinera free fire max because the free fire original version is banned so just click here install so you can use whatsapp instagram youtube whatever you want you can use it so now i already installed these two apps like free fire max and call of duty but before that you need to change some setting to get the best performance from your system so just click on this gear icon and it will open this settings so you need to change the resolution what kind of monitor you have like 1080p or 1600 720 so i have 1080p so i'm going to select this here you can see cpu codes it is recommended for so how would you know like how many codes you have 
so basically right click here go into task manager go into performance here you will see course so i have six course here so that's why it is showing four course here maybe you have two course or maybe one course if you have one core it is not going to work perfectly if you have two course so you can select core one but i have a six course so i can select the four because if i select all cores so it will not work perfectly or smoothly it will lag because uh, some other tasks also running in background to use that cpu so if you acquire all the course here so your system will hang so select according to your course okay so basically i have 32 gb ram so i'm going to select this 8 gb if you have 8 gb you can select 6 gb or you can select 4 gb okay so all things are going to work smoothly and just go into model so in model you will see here set up high frame rate so it depends upon your monitor so i have 144 hertz monitor so it is showing me 120 fps model so just select the higher one okay and go into game settings and here you can see frame rate so i'm going to select 144 fps so just click here confirm so now we have enabled higher frame rates as well and other settings you don't need to change anything here so it is saying restart now so just restart ld player so now we have restarted on the right side you can see here key mapping so key mapping is also available so if you want so you can also use this feature so you can see i have installed this free fire and click open it you can also set it on full screen so just press f11 or you need to grant some permissions here click confirm allow and it is downloading some resources here to run this game so here you need to sign in with your facebook or guest or more options are here you can use your google account as well okay so i have logged in with my google account just tap here to begin so now you can play your game so just click here start So that's how you can use Android 9 on your Windows PC and you can play any game you want without any kind of problem. So okay guys that's it for this video I hope you enjoyed watching this video so just hit the like button and do subscribe if you are new on this channel.